Hello friends. In previous chapter, we saw about types of matter, types of element compound and mixture. Today we are going to start the second chapter, metals and non-metals. The elements are generally classified into three types metal, non metal, and metal. And you know the use of metals and non metal in our day to day life. All the objects or material in the world are made up of elements, compounds, or their mixtures. And scientists classified all the elements into three general types, which are already I told you metals, non metals, and metals. So, first, say about metals gold, silver, iron, copper, aluminium, magnesium, calcium, sodium, platinum are few metals and they have luster. These metals have luster, metals are hard. Wire or sheet can be from the made metal. Metals are good conductor of heat and electricity. And metals lose their valence to produce positively charged ions. And positively charged ions are called as cations. Means metals are Hard. They have luster, luster means shine, their surface shines. Wire or sheet can be drawn from them. Now, physical properties of metal. First one is physical state. Under ordinary temperature, metal stay in solid state. But there are some metals like mercury and gallium are exceptional cases. They are in liquid state even at room temperature. You see in thermometer mercury is used. So it is in liquid state. Second property of metal is luster. Take a copper vessel at your home. There are some metals under it. I mean, surface. Means light gets reflected from the clean or freshly cut surface of metal, and the metal looks lustrous. This is second property is metal. Have luster. Metal have lusters. Third one is hardness. Generally, metals are hard, not soft. Exception: sodium and potassium metals are soft and can be easily cut by knife. Fourth property of metal is a ductility. Ductility is tannic. Uh, goldsmith means sona. Have you ever gone to a goldsmith shop? Have you seen the goldsmith making a wire of gold or silver? Sona ra chabu kana ke rakhan kati ke lo. Kabul pahal sona sona sa ande cha bhato ba sona sa bari tara kaat. When a metal is pulled or the through a hole, its wire is hot. So rakhan bhato or la. This property is called as ductility. Fifth one is a malleability. Take an iron nail, place it on a platform and keep on hammering it. Very close to the planet. And you can do it. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. 
After some time, you will see that a thin sheet is formed. So, whatever you know, you have to do the same thing. So, you have to do the same thing. Malleability means Vardhaniyata. This property is called as Malleability. Then, metal la, cocoon, such a patra, one of the three are in the room. Sixth property, conduction of heat. Means, metals are good conductor of heat and electricity. एग्जाम्पल दिले टेक अ कॉपर प्लेट किक्स सम गैस एट इट्स वन एंड एंड हिट द अदर एंड एंड ऑब्जर्व द गैस विल बी मूव इट मेंस मेटल सर गुड कंडक्टर ऑफ हिट सिल्वर कॉपर एल्युमिनियम आर द बेस्ट कंडक्टर ऑफ हिट हेल्प दे आर इट्स तुमने कुकिंग करते हो तो वो भांडे तो इनको क्या चीजें आस्था की बनाने से तो मिलते हैं लोगों को। सेवेन प्रॉपर्टीज कंडक्शन ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिसिटी। हाँ, इलेक्ट्रिकल वायर में जो जनरल कॉपर वायर रोप यूज़ के लिए लेस का कॉपर मेटल है और मेटल साथ में दुकान पर तो इलेक्ट्रिसिटी। लेड या है लेड मेटल it is neither good conductor of heat nor good conductor of electricity. The servo metal is good conductor of electricity and heat, but it is neither good conductor of heat nor good conductor of electricity. Next one is the density, Tanta. Generally, all metals have high density, but sodium, potassium, and lithium are exceptional. They have lower density as than water. The density of lithium is only 0.53 gram per cubic. Ninth property of metal is a melting point and boiling point. Melting means it will melt in the boiling point. Metals have high melting point and high boiling points. Exceptional the limit mercury, gallium, sodium, and potassium. Sonority means not. अब उन घंटा को तो साले के बेल वाज ले करी सारा आवाज़ देता रहता है वहाँ आवाज़ देता है सोना सोना रेटिंग में दे प्रोड्यूस साउंड ऑन स्ट्राइकिंग ये जो राहत के लिए तब ना तो निर्माण कर सकते हैं सोना रेटिंग से मिस मेटर सा सोना रेस ना अब वो नॉन मेटर कार्बन, सल्फर, फास्फोरस, हर सम ऑफ नॉन मेटल्स। जनरली नॉन मेटल्स आर ब्रिटल, ब्रिटल में स्टीसल एंड नॉन लस्टर्स, अन्ना चपाती है ना स्टेक। फिजिकल प्रॉपर्टीज, फर्स्ट वन इस फिजिकल स्टेक। एट ऑर्डिनरी टेम्परेचर, ऑल नॉन मेटल्स, जनरली ऑल नॉन मेटल आउटर इन सॉलिड, लिक्विड एंड गैसेस। फॉर ए and gases are hydrogen, nitrogen, oxygen. Cluster, non-metals do not have cluster, except diamond and iodine. Some non-metals are colorless, while others have different colors. Often, the course of a protected carbon is black, and sulfur is yellow, brown is brown in color. Third property is brittle. जब आपको कोसा के लिए टेक तो कोल एंड हैमर इट। सी व्हाट एप्पन टू इट सॉलिड नॉन मेटल सर्फेस पाउडर होने जाते देखिए। सम नॉन मेटल सर सॉफ्ट। डायमंड इज हार्ड। डायमंड इज वेरी हार्ड। इट इज एन एलेक्ट्रोप ऑफ कार्बन एंड इट इज एन एक्सेप्शन। व्हिच इज द हार्डेस्ट नेचुरल सब्सटेंस? डायमंड इज हार्डेस्ट नेचुरल Fourth one, ductility and malleability. Non-metals are neither ductile nor malleable. Fifth, conduction of heat and electricity. Non-metals are bad conductor of heat and electricity. Non-metals are bad. Bad means Urvaha kaayate. Teche tun bheez bao se tetna, ushnata bao se tetna. Non-metals are bad conductor of heat and electricity. Except Graphite. 
मेल्टिंग पॉइंट एंड बॉइलिंग पॉइंट ऑफ नॉन मेटल आर वेरी लो एक्सेप्शन सॉलिड नॉन मेटल्स फॉर एग्जाम्पल कार्बन बोरॉन मेल मैटर Now about metalloid. Metalloid means which show the properties intermediate between metal and non-metals. Such elements are called as metalloids. Thatu sadrusha. Metalloid la kono thatu thatu sadrusha. This shows the properties of metal and non-metal. Means metalloid means the Elements which show the properties in between metalloid and non-metalloid are called as sorry metalloid and non metals and non-metals are called metalloid. For example, arsenic, silicon, germanium, antimony, etc. In exam, the question is asked for what are what is metalloid light examples. Hmm. Now in next slide there are some questions. Try to write the answers of these. There is one assignment. Try to solve it. There are four questions. So all these four questions are now. Thank you.